Hi Stampers, welcome to Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Jill and I'm really excited about this new catalog that's coming out on the 3rd of May. And one of the stamp sets I'm going to show you, or the suite, is called He's the Man Suite. And it comes with dies, a stamp set, and the designer series paper. And I just love it because it's not just for Father's Day. It's for birthdays and just sending a card and travel, fun things. And the dies are really cool because they work with a lot of the sayings in the set. So right now I'm going to um, use for this particular card that I'm doing a Z card. And I'm not going to be using the stamp set or the dies. Those are just extra, but I'm going to be using the designer series paper. Now let me show you, these are five of the designer series papers here. I'm going to switch it to the other side. And it's just fun because there's things for barbecue, things for outdoors, things for cars, and ties, and glasses. So some really cool options. But the neatest thing about this is you get two sheets of these die cuts. And I'm just loving this. I didn't know that this was in the actual set, but you get these two wonderful sheets of die cuts. The card I'm going to be doing is with the die cuts. I'm going to cut this soft succulent cardstock at four and a half by 11. So I'm making it a long card. And then I'm going to go ahead and take and score at five and a half inches. So just right down the middle of the 11 inches. So it looks like that. Now I'm going to go ahead and fold it back. You can do it two ways. You can score it or you can just fold it back onto itself and then just crease it right here. Okay, this is creating the card that's going to open like this. But we're going to do one more step. I'm going to take this early espresso cardstock and it's 11 inches by 3 quarter inches. And I'm going to go ahead and score it right in half. So at the five and a half inch scoring. So I'm just going to fold that like so. And then I'm going to do it again, but I'm just going to do it back on itself. So it looks like a Z when you get this. And a lot of people call this card the Z card. It's like this, it faces a Z. Okay, so these are the main pieces for our card that's going to go together like this. But let's decorate it with fun designer series paper. First I'm going to use some of this He's the Man designer series paper and I'm going to put that with the soft succulent side up and just put that on this one side. This is two and a half by four for this um, piece right here. So four inch by two and a half. And this piece right here is four by three inches. And the reason why I'm doing that is because when it's on the card like this, you're gonna, it looks like it's a big piece, but when you open it up, that's where you're gonna write. So three inches by four. So I'm just gonna put this down. So it's super simple, and this, this same layout can be done for a bunch of the cards in this suite. Okay, now we're gonna take our Z piece that basically is five and a half, and then you fold that in half. Now the, the way that I like to do it is when I'm laying this down to get my spot right here, I'm gonna flip this over where the fold is, and then I could put my adhesive right here and get it right where I need to get it. And then I'm gonna flip it back over again and where that fold is, it's going to kind of rest, like kissing up to the other fold. This, And now we've got this piece that's just dangling here. 
The next thing you want to do is just flip this over and you're going to put adhesive on this part too. So you put the adhesive on the one side and the adhesive on the other. Okay, and now what we're going to do is we're just going to fold it with this already folded in place so it fits just right. So when you open it, you've got that effect like that. And so you can see when you open it. Now let's decorate it from here. Okay, I'm going to take this spot right here. Hope your day is a grand adventure. And I'm going to go ahead and hear that. This is a die cut that you actually get when the designer series paper. Remember, you get two sheets of them. Then, because I want to know where I'm going to put my adhesive, I'm going to go ahead and put my dimensionals. I'm going to flip it over and put my dimensionals exactly where they go. And then I'll flip it back over so I don't get the dimensionals or the adhesive on the other piece. So there you go. So it, there's no adhesive that's coming on this side because you don't want that to stick. So we've got the Grand Adventure. Now we're going to go ahead and use this cute little van right here and let's put that there. We'll put a couple dimensionals on that too. I just love how the designer series paper uses our colors in such a good way and they all coordinate as the most wonderful thing that Stampin' Up! does. So I'm going to put this little bus right here and pop that up. And then I think we also need an arrow like the direction that the bus is going. So these are super simple. They come out really easily. And I think we'll go ahead and just put adhesive on this and um, make it flat instead of poked up. Okay, hope your day is, as, is a grand adventure. So you open that up and you've got places to write right here on that. So this could be a great actually graduation card or if somebody's moving to a new place. As you can see, I went ahead and did this all with the cardstock and designer series paper. I didn't use any rubber stamps. So if you want to make it super simple, you can make a bunch of cards with just the die cuts that are in the designer series paper. Let me show you a couple more that I did. This one here was used with just the dies. I did stamp wishing you a happy Father's Day on the inside. You can go ahead and not put that there if you wanted to. Then the next one is number one, you're a classic and went ahead and did that fun paper with the die cut and there's nothing stamped on that. So it's a really great value. And this one, I love the barbecue theme with this designer series paper. You're flipping awesome. And then I tucked something right under here. So when you open it, holy smokes, you're amazing. That is stamped. So you can go ahead and use that. And that's the dies that cut that out that go with the suite. And then here is one just done with the paper and stamps. And no, it comes out totally flat. So I just love the options of being able to use the tags on this and they have the dies to cut these out. But the, these are amazing, these little die cuts that come in the actual designer series paper. So I hope you've enjoyed just seeing one of the new products that we have in our new catalog and that you can create many wonderful masculine card ideas with this designer series paper suite called He's the Man. These products will be available on May 3rd and there are links below so you can order yours right away. We will also have a blog post and they will share images and dimensions on that blog post. So hopefully you enjoy and we'll see you on another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.